So today I want to talk about this mouse. This is the Logitech Lift. It's an ergonomic mouse made for your hand. It's better for your posture to have your hand more vertically than horizontally. This mouse seems like it would be a great fit for pretty much every person working from home. It doesn't work for me, and this is why. My main mouse is the MX Master 3. I've had every single version of the MX Master series. It's not as ergonomic. It has this part where your thumb goes is a button that you can program to whatever you want. It has obviously a back and forward. It has horizontal scrolling up and down, which you can program each of those swipes to do different things. A top button right here, and then your middle mouse button. So I've gotten accustomed to using all of these functions in Lightroom. The Logitech Lift has less buttons. It has obviously the back and forward button right here, it has a middle mouse wheel, and even the little button right there. It lacks the horizontal scroll wheel and the thumb button. So in total, I'm losing out on three buttons that I use on a daily basis. I thought I would at least try to make it work. My editing style throughout the years has changed dramatically in how I edit. Going from easy keyboard shortcuts to mic shortcuts, implementing different variations of those two things and then also adding a third object which is the palette system it's just a bunch of knobs dials and sliders i edit mainly in lightroom also edit in davinci resolve these little things help for instance like the horizontal scroll wheel it's nice to scrub through a timeline with that if that's not something you do this is a super cool mouse and i think it looks fantastic on a desk if you're going from an mx master to this ergonomic design there is a slight quality difference. You can tell the plastic is a little bit cheaper, a little bit worse. This back of rubber right here feels really nice though, and I think it really matches the design language that they've implemented with these other mice and with the grooves and stuff. It just adds a little bit of texture and character to the mouse. Would I recommend this mouse? Absolutely. If you're just an everyday power user on your computer like I am, where I spend most of my days in front of this machine right here, editing photos and working on videos, I think this would be a great mouse. It looks cool, it feels nice, the ergonomic design is different. I think it will help with any fatigue. If Logitech made another mouse that married this design with the MX Master, would I switch to it? Absolutely. But in my case, I will unfortunately have to return this. And that's a bummer because I like switching things up. This mouse almost made me do that. Logitech, if you're listening, this mouse could be a little bit cooler if you added some more buttons and knobs, in my opinion. Buy this mouse if it looks interesting to you and you don't use as many buttons as I do. That is all. Thank you so much for watching and listening to me. If you like this content, let me know below. That is all. And I guess I need to sign off. Hmm. Goodbye, my darlings.